Hi, we're doing hurricanes just very quickly. I'm touching all the subjects very quickly. I'm not too sure how many people really are watching this. So um, we are uh, going to see hurricanes coming in. It's a rough total of five actually on the West Coast. They're increasing, as I said, every year. And um, they're, I'm only covering three of them. Th uh, one is coming in pretty tightly packed and it's coming in from this end down. And um, it's, its base is really quite wide because it does touch the Hawaiian Islands down there, which I'll move over here for you. So it's actually gonna cut, cut in and then a funnel and come down and then, and it'll be about a um, F3, um, as bad as that, but it really won't touch the Hawaiian Islands. So it's gonna come and travel roundabout the whole system is actually going to hit Baja California and then come down more or less um, this area here. Oops, sorry. Let me just move around. I'm wasting time here. Into Mexico. So the others are, um, there are about three, two more coming in and this is in July. Um, there's one um, nasty one round about the 17th coming in and it's traveling down here and moving into really the tip of Baja California, just kind of predicted to hit California, um, San Diego, LA, but it really brushes it. There is bad weather, but it really comes down here. Another one coming in and it's curving round, um, but it's it's predicted at um, NF2, but quite frankly, it's okay, um, and depletes its um, storm much before it hits again, and it's kind of affects this whole coastline, okay? And that's it for the east co uh, west coast. Let's go to the west co uh, east coast, which is more prevalent to being hit by tornadoes. And we are going to see quite a few. I'm seeing at least 18. Okay, and I'm reducing it because it's coming in from not only here, but it's also coming in from um, this area here and coming and affecting our coast here. I'm going to cover as much as I can. Um, ca sorry, I had said F three on the Hawaiian, but it's a category um, three, okay, for Hurricanes Cat. Um, I am seeing one, looks like they're predicting a Cat five, but quite frankly, it's a Cat three and a half, four, um, going into the East Coast here, into Florida, and it's coming in probably from here, hitting some warm area, which is coming in from the Gulf and from down here and it's kind of really meandering and then it gains force and comes down to the through the Bahamas and um, kind of heading towards Miami um, and the east coast of Palm, Palm Beach, Orlando, that stuff. But it's going to land at about a cat one, uh, two ish, um, still do some damage, but quite frankly, and high tides, okay? Then there's one that's coming in more of a um, Cat 4 to Cat 5, and that's coming in, and it's, it's coming in late August and coming into the Gulf and hitting this area here. So this Texas right through here is going to be hit. But quite frankly, it's even though it's it's building here and they're projecting a cat, they're saying cat five, but quite frankly, it's a cat three to four. There are gonna be high tides, high wall of water, stuff like that here, okay? And that's going to be it. Um, as I said, I, I don't know if I even said this, but 18 um, category um, named hurricanes coming in. And as they come in, I'm not going to touch on it too much here, there are going to be about three coming into the coast and then hitting um, Carolinas here and the east coast up there to further up. But I'll try and put out videos a few days before they, after they've been predict, uh, after they've been tracked, I'll try and predict them for you um, 
and you know do short little videos which I'll upload okay because I don't want to um, this one's going to be a I won't say quick and dirty but quick um, all these predictions so um, that's going to be the hurricanes for next year again 18 at least